I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's begin. Our first endeavor into the Black Reliquary. As the age-old saying goes, how much is your life worth? And of course, we gotta get our provisions as well. So we get a firewood, three honing oils, and a ginseng powder. A blend of ginseng and lesser botanicals can bolster the body's resilience. This oil brings edges to a razor sharpness while applied. Okay. I think we're probably going to want to get a shovel. I don't want to assume that we're not going to need one. I don't know what's going to happen with our very first endeavor in this, in this modded playthrough, so let's go ahead and pick those up. Or that up, I should say. I like getting eight food here. But maybe 12 just to be a little safer. Two bandages, two antidotes, anti venoms. These salts can remedy certain ailments on the body. Yeah, we'll pick one of those up, sure. Laudanum, yeah, we're familiar with that. Reduce horror. Get rid of horror, reduce stress, I believe. Honing oils, we already got. We already got one of those. I'll pick up a key, and then we'll probably want to go ahead and pick up like eight torches, that seems right to me. It's all kind of coming back now. A set of tools for the purpose of carefully unearthing and revealing lost artifacts. A set of herbs, medicines, and tools used to tend symptoms and stabilize disease. Huh. Cool. That seems pretty good. I think we're ready. <laughs> yeah, I'm very impressed with everything so far. The voice actor in particular, yeah, he he's doing great. The art for everything, the the main Hamlet area now looks sensational. Love it. We're back. Your heroes all carry different beliefs in their hearts. Some are devout to the light, some worship the pagan, pagan deities, and some reject the gods entirely. Each type of affiliation has different advantages and disadvantages in combat. And while some heroes cannot fall into certain faiths, one can only be one of the three. Okay. Very interesting. Oh, man. Ah, oh, we're playing Darkest Dungeon! I love this game. This game's great. Isn't this game great? This is a great game. I like playing this game. Heroes have new and unique properties which are detailed in the additional info pop-up found in the toolbar. The selection doesn't need to be equipped to take effect and is only used to give info about the class. Thank you. I did figure that out. Well, it's all right, Justin. We'll be fine, buddy. <laughs> Battle in the valley will be different from what you are accustomed to. Enemies and allies alike take advantage of a moment to brace themselves for combat. Ah, here's the preparation round. Okay. Accuracy for ordinary attacks is halved, and critical hits are impossible. However, some abilities are free of this penalty and can be used for an initiating strike, like the occultist abilities we saw. I think I need to turn this music down again, too. Depending upon the intelligence of your adversaries, they may utilize this opportunity to give themselves particular advantages. Alright, hold on a second here. Sorry, we gotta turn this down just a little bit more. It's a little too intense, man. Wait. A little, a little too far down that time. There we go. Happy balance. Alright. So the occultist, as we mentioned, is one that is uh, able to take advantage of this uh, lack of preparation round disadvantages. So let's try that out. All right, never mind then. I'm just, I just look like a big dumb dummy. Although, okay, yeah, on the prep round it does all those things. That sounds like fun. Let's do that. Nice. Okay, so, oh, right, yeah, of course, she's not going to be able to, uh... Oh, uh, I might have to put her in slot three, actually. I just realized, yeah, the buckshot's not going to be avail available in the back line. Uh, this is, yeah, I just realized... <laughs> Toasty! Toasty! You said no conflicts, Toasty! He, he lied to me. He lied to me. That's not, that's not working. <laughs> Hang on a sec. Yeah, let's just go ahead and roll with that one. Sorry, NLSS version. Not gonna happen, I guess. Uh, do it. 
Oh, right, we're just cycling through those right now. I guess I could just move her forward. I suppose that's all I've got to do anyway. Now let's try to get, get the stun on this guy, sure. Oh, you can't... I think you can't stun in the prep round either, I guess. I know it said you can't crit, but it didn't, it didn't look like it even gave me the option to stun. Let's see. Let's, uh, let's not worry about the heal just yet. I want to try the Amber Curse. Oh my god, uh-oh. Okay, so the skins aren't working very well. <laughs> we might have to abandon that track, unfortunately. That's fine, though. We're obviously much more concerned about uh, showcasing the Black Reliquary mod here. Let's see if maybe uh, the Bear Taffy Man at Arms can survive. He's doing okay so far. There we go. Nice. Some quirks develop as a result of ongoing combat against different enemy types. Hmm. That's cool. Okay. Each item, if you take it, will occupy space in your inventory, of course. Talk. Those are one of the resources we need, so we'll definitely take those. You can stun, but the resist pop-ups no longer show up. Oh, that's what's going on. Okay. Let's do it. A rare reiteration of room curios. Vendors accept only a specific type of item and offer up valuables in exchange. Cool. Kvaritz Vending Golem. It seems to only take currency from the Kvaritz era. Uh, here. Be gentle. For sale or for study, these artifacts are precious. Cool. That's pretty good. I can totally use those right now. Who needs more accuracy? Probably you. Maybe even give you both. Let's give you both. Accuracy and speed. I like that. Alright. Man, look at me hitting tab like a professional. I didn't, I, that was just instinct. I was like, yeah, that's the button. I remember what to do. Let's go that way. Ah, good thing I brought a shovel. More than our enemies will attempt to impede us. Yeah, I'm liking this new narrator. Some abandoned Levantine equipment. Hmm. Let's, uh, let's just take it. They were well supplied. Ooh, nice. All right. No problem. Hey, Chubber. There's my boy. You so good? What you doing, bud? Okay. Mm -hmm. Chubs. Chubs. What you doing? You wagging? There's a good buddy. Light is fading. What is this? The sarcophagus untouched for centuries. This one was laid to rest with riches. Nice. Mine. That's a good luck, Chubbs. That's right. That's right, buddy. Thanks for hanging out with this dude. Hmm. Ah, here we go. Our foes think themselves indomitable. Teach them the truth. Ah, we surprised them. Nice. I like the abyssal. Actually, I can only I can only hit one target there, so we might as well hit the one target more effectively. Let's go with the more accurate shot too. Sounds good. Debuff self. Lower damage, additional damage received, and there's a little visual element to that, too. That's kind of cool. Alright. Let's go with, uh... Light Defender here. Keep the Musketeer out of harm's way. They did a lot of damage when they hit, so... Prefer to avoid that, uh... Stacking up too much too early on here. No stuns either there, unfortunately. Damn. So let's see. I don't know if they have armor. I don't think they do. 
I assume that's something that we'll be able to see. I'm pretty sure it is. Let's see what Concussive Ammo is going to do for us. Some bleed. Or we can just go with the Stun Resist Lowering, which I think I like the bleed the most. Let's see if we can uh, do some damage to this guy. Oh, is that that's just protection, right? Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's what that is. You're right. Ah, shit. Yeah, again, yeah, it's going to take a couple times to refresh my memory on all this stuff. There we go. I'd love to uh, get his retribution up, too. No damage over time so far. That's good. Oh, plus 20% healing done if target is pagan. That's cool. I guess we can't really see that in combat, right? And the only one that's pagan in this squad right now is him, so... Doesn't make a huge difference at the moment, but... Holy cow, okay. That's pretty damn good. Let's see if the bleed hits. Yeah, they're fairly vulnerable to it. Oh, yikes. Yeah, they can hurt, too. Nice, there we go. Four more damage, or two more damage to get the Ford to be the finishing blow. Unfortunately, didn't land that, but oh well. There goes all the healing for this dungeon, right? Yeah, for real. All the lot gone in one heal. Yeah, let's give him a buckshot. Well, actually, the bleed's already going to kill him, so that's probably a waste. Hmm. Let's try that. All damage and HP values are doubled for ally and foe. Oh, I see. So yeah, it did, it did feel like these guys are a little bit tankier than I'm used to. But that also means, I suppose, right, yeah, that those values are going to be a lot higher for the heals typically, right? Because that's a wide range. That's a much wider range than I remember it being for the beginning of the game for the occultists, now that I think about it. Ice Princess, thank you for the 50 months as well. Welcome on back in. Appreciate your resupport, or resubscription. Air hugs if you got them. Let's go ahead and pop another heal. That's pretty good. I like to keep them above 60 if I can. 60%, that is. Let's go for this, since they really seem to like targeting her right now. Maybe get at least one of these reposts going. We're gonna have to reset it though, I guess. Just like back in the day, man. Just like back in the day. Go ahead and bring her up to full with the occultist. Very nice. No bleeds either, that'll do. Hell yeah. Let's get everybody up to full, why not? Why not? Boom. Yeah, this is already going great. Already going great. Oh, I dare you. I double dare you, motherfucker. Salvage jewelry. And an onyx. Nice. Alright, already running out of space, though. Shit. Ah, uh, let's see. Obviously, I want to make that switch, but I don't think I want to give up everything just yet. I wonder what this actually does. Oh, it's a buff. Cool. Some resistances. Yeah, I'll take that. Neat. Alrighty. Nothing in here, I guess. We should probably camp soon, I guess. Since it's such a tiny dungeon. Not a lot of other, uh... Oh, shit. Big boy. Firewalker! Okay, let's see. Hmm. Oh, additional damage versus Amber Blighted. That's cool. I just realized that. That's a big boy. That's a big, big boy. Let's try the Yop again. I haven't had a lot of luck with it so far, but I feel like, yeah, no, that's... Alright. That's fair. Uh, keep on defending. Little bear in arms. And... Let's see if I can stack a few bleeds on this big boy. Oh, it's a 50% chance to hit. What the hell? Oh, right, yeah, it's prep round, duh. Duh. 
Let's do this then. I gotta get used to that actually. That, that first turn accuracy debuff, yeah, I gotta, I gotta remember that. Repressurize. He is gonna be. Attacks can't be reposted. Horror applied. And armor piercing. Oh boy, okay. That's pretty scary. Lowering his damage seems to be a pretty good idea to me. Let's go, uh... Try to stun again? Yeah. Nice! Hey, there we go! I knew I could do it. I knew it was still an option. Nice. Alright, this is a good start. Let's stack those bleeds up. Oh, he's gonna guard. Yeah, okay. I should have considered that. Not too much protection, but we'll go ahead and use the, arm, the armor piercing rounds, probably. Gonna go for that. Hmm, she's still debuffed, right? Yeah. Oh, no, that's just a cooldown. Oh, okay. Let's just go for the big smack, then, I guess. It works. Bye, bear. Or, I was gonna call him Bear. Bye, Jubs. Uh, I guess if we do this, then it's gonna hit this guy, right? Yeah. Nice! Do not relent. Good stuff. Alright, big boy, what you got? Uh oh! Did your gun break? Oopsie! Oopsie whoopsie! Alright, so he's got a ton of resistance now. Uh, I can't repost him, so I guess... Just bonk him. Bonk him on the noggin. Give him a nice little stab. And goodbye. The scavengers will be well tonight. Nice. Another skirmish, another step forward. No sweat, dude. No sweat. Ooh. Uh, key. Nice. Secure it and march on. Yo! Much to do. That's a pretty big find. Hell yeah. Got a scout done as well? Let's see who's the best at this. Hell yeah, it is. There we go. Nice. Beautiful. Hidden riches! Amazing! And an emerald. Oh boy. I think we can probably get rid of the uh, bandages and the laudanum. Seems good. Yep. Oh, right, yeah. There we go. Now we back it up. Back it on up. And then we go back to there. Oh, shit. They try. Ah, they did. They snuck one in on me. Those sons of bitches. Unseen dangers. Got that taken care of. Probably gonna go ahead and camp in the second to last room here. Seems wise. Nice. Okay. I am sure the previous owner will not mind. Hmm. Oh, cool. Disease resist. Trap disarm chance. Nice. That's pretty neat. That's a big party. Alright. The real deal now. Let's see. Let's try to, uh... Try to focus one down. This is basically blind. Yeah, this is my very first time ever seeing anything in this mod. Miss it. Ah, frick. Diseases begin with symptoms, which are more gentle than the fully contracted disease. Who's there? That's a Chubbs. Always oh, got a snack. You've got a peanut butter treat in there. Flame onion! Thank you for the three months on the Powerwalk Mod back in. 
Disease kit provision items can be used to further treat these symptoms and diseases to lessen their effects, but they can only be removed in the sanitarium. Ah, oh, man. All right. Do I have a disease removal kit? I think I do. Oh, I think I just used the one I had. Yeah, darn. Oh, well. Let's go to shrapnel ammo. Kaboom. And we'll go for the bleed. Nice. And one more blow. Actually, I think I can kill him with this. Ah, shit. I gotta keep in mind that loss of accuracy there. Okay, the occultists might be in a little bit of trouble with that amount of blight. Gotta be careful about that. I might want to guard him, actually. I'm pretty sure I do. Oh, yeah. That's, that's not good. Let's get rid of that. Go ahead and heal. Yeah, that's more like it. That's what we're used to with the occultist. Uh, let's just go for the big old shot here. There's really not a lot of damage to be done with that, unfortunately, but I still feel like it's a pretty good play. Nice, that's a lot better. Jolik! Thank you for the four months of the pot. Welcome on back, I appreciate it. Bear hooves. Baby. Bear be. Mm-hmm. I'll hit him with a wicked hack. Nice. We'll play a little defensive here. Don't want to take any unnecessary chances this early on, especially right before we, uh... Especially right before we're about to camp. There's a powerful blight there as well. We need to anti-venom that sucker. Bop. One HP. Bear optimal. Uh, let's just go for the... Oh, wait. No, he's guarding, right? There we go. That'll do. And try to... No, we can't reach the stun, I guess. We'll just do that. Oh, my God. Barret arm's struggling. Keep shooting. That'll do. Leave him on, but man, can't help but do the bear optimal, huh? Just inherent, and in, it's just in my blood. Nice. Might as well use that. All right, so we got to be concerned about our occultist symptom: a cough, lower disease resists, lower dodge. All right. It's camp. The dark and the cold are upon us. Keep each other safe by the fire. And just in case we have to eat food again in the last hallway, we'll just have half. And let's see what skills we got. Tactics is pretty good. Maintain equipment's really good too. Battle trance is nice. Hmm. Ooh. Oh, boy. Prevent ambush, but give all the heroes horror. That's pretty rough. I don't know about that. I love clean musket. I think I'll do that. Do tactics. Oh, that's a companion. Oh, I think the repost is still for him, though. Yeah, pretty sure that's right. We'll do this. And then, do I have an encourage I could use on her? I do. Nice. It's all coming back to me, man. Alright. We're risking the nighttime ambush here, though. Let's do it. Bye, Chubbs. Perhaps we could forge some berries? Some berries? Some berries? Some berries? Right? No! Oh, ambush! Shit.
and the curse. So scary. Look at this. <laughs> it's like, rawr, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> uh, oh, you're way too far in the back. What the hell are you doing there? Nice. Faritz Gagal? Am I reading that right? Uh, stun chance is pretty low, unfortunately. That's no good. We'll go for this. Nice. They're already surrendering. Yeah, we give up! We're certainly getting pretty lucky with our dodges here. Buckshot's really good. A decent stun chance, but they have so much resist, it's probably not even worth trying. Yeah, let's try that. Nice! Some monsters have high protect, which absorbs attack damage. The DOTs ignore protection and effective means to take down these highly armored opponents. They are indeed highly armored. I just realized that too. This guy's not so much. He'll probably die to that. Let's go for a retribution. Probably pretty effective. Heal our boy. Our injuries will mount. We must rebound. Very good. And we're looking at some armor piercing, which is beautiful for this. Almost dead. I ought to kill him, actually. Nice. Hey, we resisted the move, too. Ooh, the pull forward, okay. Entrapping reconstitution. Why? No, don't do that. Naughty. Naughty boy. No, 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 no. Knock that off. Oh, God. Stress, okay. I want to kill this thing. I don't like this thing. I don't want that to be around anymore. I'm gonna get some bleed on this boy. Oh, he's got 200% bleed resistance. That's not gonna happen, is it? There we go, that'll do. You just gotta get a real fast crit in there. I'll take care of it. Okay. Healing up. There we go. Oh, we're doing just fine now. Not a problem. I'm not gonna come back, right? Okay. Whoa! Wow. Yeah, go ahead and ambush me more often. I don't mind it. Holy shit. Okay. Um, I guess I'll just use that. Oh, cool. Got rid of the uh, debuff. That makes sense. Sick, dude. That went very well. A stone slab containing dark Kvart's knowledge. Uh, I'm probably butchering that pronunciation. Hmm. Yeah, just try it. Great insight into these lands. Oh, cool. Nice. Interacting with traps and obstacles in the catacombs successfully gives buffs. Plus four dodge, plus two speed. Yo, that's dope! That's really good. Where's the party reorder button? There it is. I gotta move you to there, though. So I think I do that. How do I do that again? You there. There we go, that's it. Thank you, shovel. This land is ancient and fallen into disrepair. No! Mm. I step lightly. <laughs> Trying. Ugh. Yeah. Oh boy, okay. A little, like, mini boss fight here. What do we got? I'm having trouble reading the words sometimes. Mendicant Friar, I want to say that is. Pilgrim Levy. Cleric Errant. Alright. 
Healy Boys is what I would expect here. So maybe we'll go for one of them middle dudes. In the herd a bit. Oh, shit. Okay. Cool. Yop has pretty good odds at stunning at least one of these guys. Alright, never mind. Oh boy. Is the guard up? Hmm. I can go armor piercing here. That chance to hit is pretty low. I want to patch up the Hellion, actually. That seems like a pretty good idea. Play a little safer. Oh, did we confirm that there's no stun on the first round? I didn't realize that, sorry. Oops. Oh, that's what that, oh, that's what that's saying. The tooltip is saying that the debuff only applies in the first round. Okay, got it. Your hero is... Explit, ex... <laughs> it's the damn tiny resolution, I'm sorry, expiated. New statuses are applied in combat for both friends and foes such as Amber Blight, Expiation, and Enrage. Amber Blight applies an ongoing debuff to the target. Damage to the target whenever they attack and will end after triggering three times. Dealing damage to the target and healing the caster's team. Oh, shit. Time to get a thesaurus, right? Yeah, shit. Okay, so he cannot attack or he'll heal the enemy. That's a fun little visual effect, too. Let's heal him up. Some skills can still stun in the first round, okay. They just will probably say that, I assume. So we're gonna just probably guard for two turns here and boost his uh, protection stat. Although I guess I have to do it, because it's just going to stay on him otherwise. I suppose, yeah, it's just, just got to deal with it. These guys seem pretty, uh, their synergy is beginning to concern me. I want to try to just kill this guy. It seems like a good idea. Yeah, that works. Double taco with the bits, something, something bits for crits. I mean, there you go. Immediately paid off. Hmm. There you go. He just shot an old man. Well, he expatiated me. He he expatiate. Expat. He was mean. He started it. Expecto Patronum! Hmm. I mean, yeah, I kind of just need to do it. So, we'll see how effective it actually is. Oh, it didn't actually heal them. Huh. this again? Oh, on completion it heals, right? Okay, yeah. Got it. Got it. You need to move him back again, probably. Oh, whoops, right, yeah. Man, come on, Hellion. Ooh, very, very scary hammer of faith. So startled. Right, that is uh, got one more, one more activation. This boy's just tanking it, tanking it all up. More than happy to take another heal opportunity if it affords it to me. No, oh, never mind. That'll work. Oh, sweet. We press on. There is much to do. Nice. 
Let's go with uh, boom, 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 kablam. He's done it. He's freaking done it. Just a quick peek. Yeah, that's it. That's the whole thing. Good stuff. Ah, I missed that noise. Mm-hmm. That's bringing us back, isn't it? That's a pretty damn good first dungeon. That's a lot of money. Hell yeah. All right. Let's see what our uh, result is here. Inaccurate. Oof. That's tough. Unfortunate. Oh well. Back home. To return here after so long. It is difficult to describe exactly what this land means to me. Over time, some negative quirks will lock into place and become severe. Severe negative quirks cost much more to remove in the sanitarium. Okay. Well, let's go get... Oh, hi. Welcome to the airship. Thanks. While the appearance may be different, many of its features operate similarly to the hamlet. Certain aspects will vary, such as stress relief activities and the removal of quirk locking. The exterior is changed, but the interiors are not finished, and more changes are to be anticipated as the mod progresses in its development. Cool. Let's see. Can we get rid of inaccurate? We can. Let's do that now. And let's see if we can get ourselves a new healer. On the ferry. Hmm. Houndmaster. It's Malfi. We'll see if his skin cooperates. We gotta get a Malfi, of course. Pick that up. In a time of untrustworthy people, a dog is a beacon of faith. We're gonna pick up a Crusader. The Sands welcomes those who truly fight in the name of the light. And we'll get an abomination. There is always a place here for those who have been wronged, only to rise above. I might do this too. Yeah. Why not? Give us some more recruits. It's a good idea. Alright. So, I'm going to run to the bathroom real quick, but while I'm doing that, let's go ahead and do the pick me. So, type P-I-C-K-M-E in the chat right now. If you'd like to be entered into the drawing, we will select three names from Moobot's raffle to choose as our new roster members, our new Houndmaster slash Foxmaster, our new Crusader, and our new Abomination. While you're doing that, I'm going to take a quick bathroom break. Come on back in just a couple of minutes for more Darkest Dungeon Black Reliquary. Take me in now. Last call. P I C K M E in the chat. Ugh, Crusader is NL skin. Abomination is Apollo. I'll try him out. I'll certainly give him a go. I'm a little concerned though, based on our previous experience. Let's load him up though. Let's rename our Malfi first. 
Our first new member of the squad, Cracked Hoof. I like that name a lot. Welcome into the team. Our Houndmaster. Our new Crusader. There he is. Draw the winner here. Zack Lion, how appropriate. It's like, it's like Moobot knows. And finally, our abomination. Generous bestowal. Violet Kitten. Congratulations. Get on in there. Welcome to the team. There he is. <laughs> That's a very good one. I like that a lot. You should be able to post links, Kurt. D. Yeah, it should be fine. Let's see. I think that's it then. Ready to go. Let's go for uh, mission number two. A generous beast Mystic of Envoy. Gifting subs to our new roster members as always. Thank you again, Mystic, very much for the support. Appreciate it a lot. A resolve stone and a hindering stone. I kind of like that. That's that's a unique set of trinkets there, of course. I like those as options. It's cool. Let's go ahead and get the uh, roster cleared out here. So we're gonna need probably the Crusader here to act as kind of a healer. I'm gonna bring the Musketeer again with the Crusader up front with the Abomination. And probably the Houndmaster in slot three. That way, all three of them can heal. Or at least the Houndmaster can self-heal. And that should give us at least a pretty good uh, set of choices for, for, the, uh, for the healing options in the run. Crusader's Battle Heal is actually not ass now, I hope. Let's take a look at that, yeah. Inspiring. Oh, no, wait, no, hold on. Heal 6 HP. Heal increased by 25% for every 25 stress on the target. That's pretty goddamn good, yeah. So that gets that up to a potential of, like, heal for 10 on an ally with 50 stress. That's pretty goddamn good. That's really nice. And then, of course, he's got his stress heal, too. Might actually go... Hold on. Oh, other religious heroes. Despite the cru wait, why is the Crusader faithless? Isn't that seems kind of weird? Pagan. Religious abomination. Hmm. Oh, it's just random. It's not a sign. Okay, that's that makes more sense. Just per hero. He's a fan of the band, I see, yeah. Well, that's interesting, okay. Hmm. Let's see, we'll probably go with... I actually kind of like this set of four, although I really do want to have his heal available. So we'll probably take off... Zealous for the battle heal here. And let's go with... I don't think I... Well, yeah, you know, let's go for the extra experience, why not? I feel like I might as well. I don't think he needs either the accuracy or the speed. I think I kind of want to just go ahead and give both of these to her again. Keep her heal available. She's got the change ammo. She's going to have to be in slot 3 for this to work the most effectively. Alternatively, I can swap out Buckshot for Bombard, and that's fine. That feels good to me. Abomination, of course, has all his skills. Don't need to worry about that. No other trinkets ready to go. Let's do it. Let's get it going, dude. Untalented. I disagree. I just see nothing horrific. Unholy machinations have crushed together hallway and vault. Explore your ancestral home as far as you are able. Here in the catacombs. Let's do it. Wonder if other religious characters won't go with the bombs. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting, isn't it? Very interesting so far. 
So we're going to be given two firewoods for this one. A couple of the doggy treats. Aru-ru-ru-ru. We'll do uh, two shovels. I like 16 food, actually. That seems like a good, a good amount. Two venoms, two bandages. Well, we already have an anti-venom, actually. So that works. Eight torches is probably okay. And a couple of keys. I don't know about bringing any of these yet. So we... Well, I suppose I give myself a better chance of figuring out what they do by bringing them along, but I already got a pretty full inventory, so I feel like that's probably not a great idea. In fact, I don't think I want to bring that either. Yeah, let's go ahead and roll out with that. Sounds good. Hit it. That's a good question, Show. Any dev able to answer that? How many hours of content does the mod add? I suppose it's a uh, question that's going to change as the mod develops, because we got to keep in mind this is still beta version 0.1. All right. Let's do it. Hopefully the skins will uh, hold up for us here. That's certainly a little bit bigger, isn't it? Players, sure, yeah, that makes sense. Wow, okay, he's dead. He must be more vigilant. <laughs> Goodbye, Malf. Man, that sucks. We only had him for a couple minutes. He, he was crushed by the pneumatic press to a bloody pulp. I'll go that way. Torch time. This is a pretty, uh, Standard start. It enriches. Nice. Mr. Bokarian. Welcome back. 48 months on the bear pile. Bear hugs form. Welcome on back in. Thank you so much for all the subscriptions and resubscriptions today, folks. Really appreciate it very, very much. Gentle. For sale or for study, these artifacts are precious. Oh, shit. Nah, Let's get rid of that now. Mouth is pleased to know that you're using toasty skin of him. Please let him know I apologize for the fact that he's now been crushed to a bloody pulp. It's really unfortunate. Ah, it seems completely inert. Just like me. More than our enemies will attempt to impede us. All oh, right, Torch. This has been pretty boring so far. <laughs> Where the hell are all the enemies? Offers riches in exchange for supplies. Huh. You want a... You want an anti-venom? Huh. Doesn't hurt to be careful. Our cause is righteous. Cool. But requires funds. Okay. That worked. I was gonna give him a dog biscuit. Yeah, I was thinking about it. There we go, finally. Good lord. Let's see. Hmm. Anything that the Musketeer tries to do in the prep round is probably going to be pretty unlikely to hit. But if it does, obviously, that's pretty goddamn good. I don't really need to patch up, but I could patch up the Houndmaster right now. Hmm. Yeah, let's try it. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, almost done with the first round. Light's a good idea, but again, that's a pretty low chance to hit. Yeah, I'll give it a go. Yeah, it makes sense. Let's see. Hounds Harry. Another very low chance. Ah, plus 50% guard duration applied on prep round. Definitely want to do that. Definitely like that. Okay. Oof. Yeah, Houndmaster's gonna need to heal himself, probably. Let's go for Bulwark. Oh, this adds Torch as well. Nice. And then the uh, Abomination will get the buff from this as well. Cool. Nice. Good stuff, Malfi. 
I think we'll go with this to begin with. There we go. I could heal now, but I like Hound's Harry as well. Their bleed resist is pretty low. DOT on these guys is going to do the job pretty well. Especially if I can just knock this dude out. Might be able to. That uh, crit chance is pretty low, though. Hmm. It's going to crit. Ah, oh, man. Oh, well. Okay, a little damage on Apollo. No big deal. Still don't necessarily feel I need to battle heal. Let's take the 50-50. Yeah, this music is pretty great, isn't it? It's all been very impressive so far. Nice dodge, Malfi. Little horror there, not too bad. It's actually pretty insignificant. Yeah, this has all been very, very impressive so far. Go for that, sure. Yeah, this DOT is already having extremely good effects here. Oh, man. What do you mean to him? Knock that off. Doesn't have any stress, so the heal's not going to be extremely effective. I suppose it is time to just whack him. Whack him with a stick. And Bombard's not a bad idea here, actually, especially because he's already got a bleed that's going to be nearly enough. Although, if I do that, then I have to get at least one more hit on him before he dies. But I want to do it because I'm greedy and I spread damage out like an idiot. Yeah! At Luna Conger! 49 months on the bear pile. Welcome on back to you as well. Appreciate it. That horror, thankfully, is not really that bad. That seems super significant to me. I think if I get one more Blight here, this guy might die. Oh, I think he's one off. Oh, I didn't get the Blight there anyway. All right, no big deal. Well, there's our Bombard, I guess. It's certainly going to take care of the last guy, and then that's pretty close to killing the second dude as well. And that's certainly nice. It's going to be a lot more damage on the next shot, though, of course. Now Terry ought to do it. I'm just spread the damage around like an idiot, man. Yeah, no, I definitely should have just attacked this individual guy. <laughs> So dumb. Hey, Calix, glad you're enjoying the uh, multiverse stuff. You have a favorite mod race? There's a lot of them, aren't there? Man, there's so many more than I thought there would be when I first loaded it up. The orchids are cool. I like the um, I like the ghosts and the ghouls. Those add a lot of fun stuff too. Oh, that's very little healing. I just realized. I thought that was a lot more HP healing than it was. Let's do that. Oh, nice. The body's weaknesses are exploited. Dude, this narrator is actually pretty great. Oh shit! Once the blood flows, the end has begun. Okay. Uh-oh. Let's watch out for that, I guess. Holy hell. Here comes the boom. Ready or not. Well, I gotta see if any of these guys are catacombs experts. No, okay. One of those might still have something to do with the curios. No. Alright, we're good. We're good. Probably go ahead and use a campfire here to heal up from that fight. Especially because we're already pretty far into this. Could use some more uh, inventory space anyway. Is a rare thing in this place. I'm okay with feasting. I need to start bringing more food out though. Bellboy! Bellboy Troy, thanks for the two months. Been watching since the DD beta days. Nice. Appreciate the support, thank you. Thank you for the bear hugs as well. Alright, no stress. Could use some uh, wound care, I guess. Recover some HP on these guys, that'd be pretty good. Hmm. I'll prevent the ambush wouldn't be a bad idea either. The ambush was pretty bad last time. Quickening's nice. Hmm. I go clean musket. Scout's actually really great too. I'll take I'll take Zealous Vigil too, and then go with the quickening. That's pretty good. 
pretty good. Against the light, our foes will fall. Making me want to hop in the dungeon again? I recommend it. I'm already very happy that we're doing this again. I mean, I was already excited for this, obviously, getting back in the darkest dungeon. You know I'm going to be hyped for that, but on top of the mod being high quality, I'm just really happy to be playing this again. This is a very good game still. It's always fun when we can get chat names involved, too. Stone, debris, foliage, none of it will slow us. Another big boy. I don't think I've fought this guy yet. Champion. Just fucking beating the hell out of us with his fists. Like I'm a champ or something. Alright. Let's see. Let me transform here, actually. Let's see how the transform does for me. Damn, the big crit heal off that. Very nice. Okay. Ooh, this ignores the accuracy reduction in round round one, but lower damage in round one. Uh, double knockback, though. Let's go go for it. Give it a try. Nice. Broke his guard, too. Can't be guarded. Neat. Let's go ahead and go for the uh, boosted duration guard dog. Nice. Skull Smash Dash. That fucking anime character. Okay, uh, let's go for a heal on the Crusader. Actually, let's heal the Musketeer. Ooh. Alright, alright. That's a lot of damage coming out of these guys. I better try to kill this dude before he explodes again. Let's avoid that. I'd rather that not happen. I guess we'll bulwark here too. We follow the ever guiding light. All right, big boy, what you got? The rake is gonna do fairly well here, but I think rage might be better. Nice! Holy hell! Extremely good. Let's just finish him. Ah, oh, come on now. I don't like that he keeps doing that. Oh boy, yeah, that's a lot of goddamn damage, man. There we go, one down. Oof. Taking some hits. Taking some lickings. Let's try to get some more damage in here. Okay, good, good, good. Very happy to go rage again. Oh, shit. Oof. We're starting to unload on us a little bit. Oh, man. Okay, that, that's hurting, yeah. Some bleed on him would certainly be nice. Get a little bit of damage going, there we go. We are gonna wanna heal for sure. I don't think the Crusader necessarily needs to heal, I definitely wanna try to do this. Come on, 50-50, nice! There we go. That's pretty big for us. I think it might be time to go with the rake. No, it's not. I lied. Pretty sure rake is only ever really going to be very good with the uh, with multiple targets. Nice. Do not relent. All right, I think we'll get there finally on this guy. Another rallying horn. This dude thankfully lost one of those buffs, but. If he's able to get that, uh... Oh, come on now. All right. He's got at least a bleed on there, so he's not going to be able to attack again, thankfully. But that would have sucked. Go ahead and transform down now. Get a little bit of healing done. Reduce the stress a bit. He should die. No heal available, right? Yeah, we're good. We're good. The raised fist from the corpse. I just realized that. Yeah, that's great, man. That's really good. Noise. Oh, I think I I just realized the change to patch up works better on targets below 40% HP. So that's what I'm looking for for that. Okay. Okay. Understood. I'll just go for some damage then, I guess. You will just heal the musketeer. Feeling good. Feeling good. Took a lot of hits that time, but 
able to recover fairly effectively now. Reduce our stress in the abomination. Nice! Big dodge. Oh, baby! Taffy girl! Do some with Puppet Dog, what you doing? Hello? Taffy girl. I all Ah, shit. Might as well. You're so sweet, Taffy. What you doing? You gonna land your bed? Oh, we gotta move the camera so you guys can see that. Hold on. That's yeah, a good girl. Oh, another skirmish. Another Very good. step forward. It's right over there. Hold on. Oh, that's so bad. Damn it. You balance, you dumb thing. And then, I mean, this is very important, obviously. Hold on. I know everyone feels the same way I do, that this is the uh, priority at the moment to make sure that this looks good. There's your taffy. There she is. You're so sweet. So good. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You laying in the comfort bed? Yeah? She's very good. She's a very good girl. Okay. Okay. That's better. Yep. She is a fairly recent acquisition, Taffy. Got her, I want to say like a little under a year ago. She is fitting in perfectly. Regular old member of the family already. She loves her brother. And her brother is warming up to her. <laughs> Was very jealous at the start. And pouty about it, but Be now he doesn't careful. mind so much. Oh, and after all that setup. Alright, see you later. best boy and she's best girl, so it's even, right? Yeah. No competition there. Oh, I missed something here. Oops. Hang on. The darkness will not impede us. We are the flame. Hold on. Oh, I missed this. Sarcophagus. Oh, good. Yeah, no, I'm glad I got that. Great. Perfect. Love the mod so far, SKC. Highly recommend. This land is ancient and fallen into disrepair. Very excited to play more. Whoa! My man, my man's got an eagle. Ha! <laughs> okay. Bird up! Bam, bam, bam! <laughs> Finally, an appropriate use for that effect. I don't know if that's an eagle either. <laughs> Thing's fucking huge, man. Yeah, for real. Good lord. Hmm. I think I'll just heal, I guess. That one's below 40% right now, though. But I'm almost certainly not going to land any shot. I'll just do that. Clearly suffering a bit as a result of, uh... Bringing no healer in this squad, but... Or no dedicated healer, anyway. We'll make do. 
Paolo's loving these bulwarks, dude. He's a big fan. Um, I'd rather not get reposted here. He's got a pretty low stun resistance. And he got it anyway. Or? Yeah, just some stress. Oh, he's already almost dead anyway. Ooh, shit. Okay, that's some strong damage. Um, let's go for this. This dude's almost dead. Uh-oh. Oof. Okay, he's almost at 40%. I think he needs to take, like, four more damage or something like that. Let's go ahead and just finish this guy off. That'll do. And I want to try a stun again. Those guys have a ton of resistance, though, so that's not going to work. I guess we just do this. That's still pretty good. Oh, boy. Now he's definitely below 40. These two are dead. I could go for a rake here. I am almost through his repost though, so I'd rather just get I'd rather just allow that to finish off. The stun chance here is not fantastic though. I think I'm gonna transform and go for the rage, maybe? Yeah. There we go, that's good. Then we got huge numbers advantage. And then we can start doing some healing and avoid the repose completely. Works for me. We can give her a little extra heal. Ooh, there we go, Crusader. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, good dodge. Very nice. Wow. Thank you. All right. There we go, just like that. Turns out when all the coin flips go your way, the game's easy. Uh, let's see. I guess I can just dump that. Eh, I can just get rid of that. That'll work. A small map, nice. That's helpful. Eh, why not? Let's roll three crits in a row. Yeah, it's fine. Cool. Good enough. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> okay. Just a, just a little, that tiny bop. Just a, a little tiny bop. Little, little bop. <laughs> Let's try the rake this time. Actually, no, slam is great for the prep round. No, oh, you son of a bitch. It's bonk bear, my bad. Well, it said, no, it said, the emote says bop. Clearly says bop. Bulwark. Okay. Um, and let's yeah, I don't want him to take any more damage. Hmm. Yeah, just heal. Just heal it up. And now we do this. And they dodge completely, and that's fine, because we're just building damage for the next turn. Stress for us. Well, Terry seems. Actually, no. Let's go for the backliner. There we go. Voice. Okay. That's a fun move. Uh huh. And uh, I'll just. 
hit you in the face with my sword. How do you keep dodging everything, goddammit? Cheaters. That's cool. Obviously doesn't help us very much. Oof, Alfie. Take a breather, bud. Take a second. Yikes. Got a stun opportunity here. It's a eh, pretty good chance here, actually. All right, never mind. How's he missing everything? This is getting ridiculous. Rake! All right. Stronger and stronger. Oof. Keep healing. Nice! That'll work. Uh-oh. Ow! What the hell? Okay. What the shit? Oh no. Uh... I prefer you didn't do that. Done? Hey, there we go. Yikes. There we go, there's some damage. He doesn't have a ton of HP. Ow. Good lord, there's a resolve check. Makes sense. Madness in, madness out. Mm -hmm. Oh, I get it, I know. I got an emote about it, damn it. Think I don't know? Uh, let's go with Bombard. There we go. <laughs> what in the hell is with these enemies? Dude, they're dodging way more than they should be, too. Our hit chance has been much higher than you would think. Look, it's 80% chance to hit this. Thank you. This thing is ridiculous. Levi Levantine Terpsichorean. Stunning. Getting really lucky rolls this one. There we go. Holy cow. Oh, rough. Probably gonna need to camp out after that. Thankfully, get to uh, explore this room at least. That was the whole point of going there. Hopefully no traps. Looking good. Yeah, I'll probably go to this empty room and camp there. Hey, nice Abra. Glad to hear it. I got my bear plushie sitting right in front of me. Always makes me happy to see. Ah, shit. The sweats. Ah. Oh, man. Yeah. Hey. Nice. There we go. All right. You win a few, you lose a lot. That's... That's Darkest Dungeon for you. Empty rooms. That's good. You know what? We'll probably just go ahead and go there. My game experience serves me well here, although we don't have a shovel, actually, so now that I think about that, never mind way. We're going that way. Unless we find a shovel. Empty. We do have ten food, thankfully. Back, aren't we? 
All right. Huddle together. The knights here are frigid. I have to do half, just in case we get another hunger trigger. Zealous so Vigil is actually pretty damn good here. You... Mother... Fucker. Ugh. Okay, fine. Just piss off then, you pouty little bitch. I don't even want to hear your bark about it. If you want to go die, go die. Such a baby. There we go. Finally. Here comes the ambush. Our path is revealed. Ooh. March on. Okay. All right. We gotta hope the hallway battle's kind to us. Oh, sick. Okay. There's the birdie again. Guard dog. I'm gonna use the dog biscuit this time. Wait. There we go. Dude. Ah. Oh, man. Way too many negative effects already from that. <laughs> oh, sod it. 20% resistance there, but again, we're dealing with a pretty high chance to uh, miss that shot, so. Ooh, big crit heal. Love it. Knock him back. Knock him out the box. Nice. Hey there, Moose. Oh, we do need to heal. Probably best if I just let the, uh... Let the Musketeer attempt to do it again more, though. They're six apiece. Although she's giving up a lot more damage, probably. She wasn't gonna be able to hit anybody in that round anyway. Alright, well, time for the rake. No, just kidding, he's got the repost up again. Crit kills this guy. That's also good damage. Time for the dog biscuit. Hounds rush, get the kill. Come on, bleed! There we go. That's the stuff. Only four on Hound Master, not too bad. He is hurting a lot too, though, unfortunately now. I don't know about this Hound Ma or about this Musketeer heal anymore either. Probably not the, b the best way to go. It's just crying. Just openly weeping. Get it together, buddy. Please. For all of us. Oh, baby! There we go! That's certainly timely. Nice. Let's get him. Okay. Two down. Uh, let's go for... I want to get reposted, so keep crit healing. Please and thank you. Oh! Do not surrender. We need you. Please. Please. Be kind to me. No! Oh, come on! Ah. Ridiculous. Caved in his chest, man. Jesus Christ. What were, what were we gonna do there? Okay. Sure. Mm-hmm. Yep. Just keep on caving in chests! Why, why stop now? You know? If it ain't broke. Whew. Gotta 
try. Yeah, no, please continue to cave in my chest cavities. Good God. Might as well. Okay. And let's just use this. That works. Good lord. At least it's only a level one character, right? I think that might have even been a level zero. Alright, well. We go this way. Then go back and then hit one more room, I think, and we should be good. Eventually I'll start trying some, uh... Oh no, that's another disease. Oh my god. Back to Darkest Dungeon, huh? Right back to Darkest Dungeon. This is the game we know and love. Still holding out. Just in case we see another hunger trigger. We'll just go through this last little hallway and that should be it. Come on, buddy, you got this. Let's avoid a check for you, I guess. Good, let's give him the sweats too. Yeah, let's just give literally everybody the sweats. If you wouldn't mind. Oh, God. Well, thankfully we don't need to worry about that anymore. We did it. Good Lord. More Kavrats relics kept out of Leventine. Kavrats. Excellent. Kavrats, I think is what he said. Kavrat's relics. Alright, well, we lived. Not all of us, but most of us. Rib Zack. Sorry, fella. Coward. Executioner, though, okay. A joy to have around. 4% chance to recover two stress. Okay. Wonder when that triggers. It is strange that a place so distant from the rest of the world can possess such marvelous technologies. We got rid of our uh, accuracy debuff on our occultist, at least. I'm going to have to get rid of these diseases now, too. Let's see. Let's go with... Let's get rid of the sweats on mouth slash crackled or cracked hoof. I got rid of all the debuffs on Nanel. Very true, huh? Quite so. Oh no. The Rue Waddles are invading. Um. I guess we probably don't need to upgrade Clinic to be able to. I kind of want to do this just to be able to treat another disease. Eh, why not? Well, I don't have anything particularly, um. Noteworthy I want to do. I should do this too, I guess. Reduce the cost a little bit. And then let's go ahead and remove the sweats from Violet Kitten as well. Is it time to try keys on every single curio? It might be. It very well might be. But you know what's definitely time for? Is to get four new roster members. For the repentant thief, redemption can be its own prize. There are no bounties here, but quarries are plentiful. There is no shortage of tombs to be raided in these lands. Our task requires finance. And a shield breaker. One that knows the sands and the winds is one who will not easily fall. Unfortunately, only one healer still, I think. That's rough. But four new names to draw. That's exciting. What's happening in chat? I'll tell you what's happening in chat. We're getting a pick me done. Right now. Type pick me if you'd like to be chosen. Four new roster members. We've got a highwayman, a crusader, grave robber, and a shield breaker. Let's do it. Add him in the crew. While you're doing that, let me take a peek over here. 
We might want to upgrade our weapons, actually. Where's that going to be? Forge. That would be... Oh, uh, no. That'd be a reason to keep the amber, I guess. I can swap, of course. That's always an option. Wanted to give some of this up for amber. To get nine of it, I'd have to give up, give up six. Let's do that for level two weapons. I think I like that idea. That seems pretty good. And then we'll uh, maybe level up the weapons on some guys. Let's go ahead and draw these names. Zarcius, welcome on into the squad. Let's see if we've got our... Ah, there's our Mathis, right? I'm pretty sure that's a Mathis. Congratulations, Zarcius. Welcome into the team. A bounty hunter. Lazarus Bubini. That is going to be a fun one. Welcome to the team. Who's that? Can't quite tell. Number three. Oh, Corey. Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Tia Dracor, congratulations. Welcome in. Our grave robber. A generous bestow. Those all look normal. Mystic. Thank you for another gifted to Lazarus Bubini. And our shield breaker. I think that's our custom skin there. Baldar 1869. Congratulations. There we go. Let's load up the roster. Oh, it's Kate. Do we have a... Sometimes it's just not as obvious. Anyway. I suppose we're probably going to want to bring our occultist out again here, even though obviously they're not in the greatest of shape right now. We'll probably do this. And bring a few of our new people out. Downy Hunter up front's probably good. Grave Robber and then maybe a Shield Breaker, too. Let's do the Highwayman, actually. I think I like that more. Second spot. Oh, Kate's Twitch character she uses. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Yeah, that is very much that. Indeed. That makes sense. Cool. Okay. Let's have a look at our uh, trinkets here. I actually have some options now. Bounty Hunter's probably going to want a little bit of damage. A little bit of stress there. Let's give him the resolve experience, too. Accuracy on the Highwayman. Speed, too. Grave Robber will give crit. Lowered stress. And that'll do. The Cultist skills are probably still fairly good. I think I'm actually going to swap the stab the for stole. the pole. Mystic Envoy. We bring another gifted sub to Baldar. Welcome on in the pile. Appreciate you. No grape shot this time. We'll go with a tracking shot. I like that move. And then, let's see. Bounty Hunter. Actually, we could use the Mark. Just realizing we got a little bit of Mark synergy in this squad. Appreciate it, Baldar. Thank you. Let's try the Mark on this one. I think the Highwayman can take advantage of that, too. Yeah. Nice. All right, cool. This seems good. Let's roll with it. I'm ready. Perhaps even... No, not a veteran dungeon. Certainly not... But I think I probably want to do an explore instead of a... Instead of a cleanse. It's going to be a little easier, ideally. Alright, let's do it. So early on here, I think I've realized I need a little bit more food. 
think I'll bring 20 this time. I'll bring three keys to maybe try to interact with some curios with those. A couple of these as well. I think the amount of torches we brought was probably okay. In fact, yeah, I'm going to try eight this time. See if we can get away with that. Two shovels. And... I think that'll do for now. Obviously, we could try uh, some experimenting with these things, but I think I like trying to stack up more gold early on here. In fact, actually, hold on a second. Right before I do this as well, I'm going to check on this and see if maybe we can get our weapons upgraded for these guys. Um, didn't I do that? Oh, they have to be level 2, right? Yeah, that's the thing. I know. I think it's... No, I think they do have to be level 2. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they have to be level 2. Right, yeah, they gotta be resolved level 2. Okay. That's it, then. Let's do it. Reprovision. 20... Do. Oh, I suppose, yeah, it wouldn't be a bad idea to bring a disease kit for the occultist just to suppress his cough. And I'll bring two of them just in case I can use one on a curio. Alright, then, yeah, that's probably good. That'll do. Let's hit it. They are a little pricey, yeah, uh, 500 a piece, so. Gotta be careful about picking those up. Third, dive into the catacombs. What will it yield this time? Familiarize yourself with these catacombs. Hence, we will be able to explore them easily in the coming days. Let's hit it. That's a fairly friendly layout. Stone slab containing Dark Vart's knowledge. I'm still unable to pronounce the word. <laughs> It's, uh... Well, it says it's dark. Let's light it up! That item had no effect. Ah, oh, fuck. Maxia Nivia! Return. 35 months on the pile. Welcome on back in. Bear hugs for him. Thanks for the support. Happy to have you. Wicked weapons of a forgotten era. Try a bandage. No effect. I thought maybe it would, like, protect our hands. Catacombs Tactician, cool. Nice, alright, so gotta make sure we use Lazarus on any Catacombs Curio interactions. Maybe try someone with Pagan on the really old stuff. Ah, oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Oh, look, it shows you the interaction after you figured it out. That's very good, I like that. <laughs> Key. Our cause is righteous. 1600 gold. Requires funds. Pretty good. Okay. <laughs> God, that trap is so insane. Be more careful. Okay. A heap of wrecked Vart's technology. Um. I'll try it. Razor sharp. <laughs> oh. God damn it. All right. Being told that the curio interaction thing was always the case. I'm all like I, I'm pretty much certain that is not true. It was probably a later edition. But if that's in vanilla, I, I apparently just forgot. This land is filled with unseen dangers. It was that in a later vanilla patch, yeah. Definitely has not always been the case. Nice. Be gentle. For sale or for study, these artifacts hey. are precious. So 
far so good. Very low on torches already. I think I might have to use a campfire just to get the torch light back up. I suppose I didn't uh, consider the fact that the um... <laughs> this fucking guy he is really conflicted about his feelings on the catacombs. Uh, I think I was not realizing how much benefit the Crusader's torchlight was giving me in his skill. I, I gotta bring a few more torches next time. I gotta have this guy do this, right? Yeah, he's pagan. Let's see how you interact with that. Seems completely inert. Alright, well, shit. I think we're okay to go there and then camp. T-Dog! Thank you very much for the resub. 19 months on the pile. Appreciate you very much. That's their hand on a rusted weapon. Can I just... What is that gonna do now? Feeling better already. Tend it. Oh, cool. Okay. Well, that's nice. Once the path is unclear, rely on each other. That's nice. And here we go. Huddle together. The knights here are frigid. You could probably just go with a half or a full, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. Now, can we prevent an ambush? Does anyone have that ability? No. Well, we've got this one, but I don't love that one. Hmm. Oh, wow. This is cool. Produce two disease kits. Nice. Oh, you can only have two in a stack, though. So if we do that, this is stabilized. Which the cough got worse really fast, apparently. I'm gonna have to treat those diseases. Let's go ahead and give him the uh, review contract. That seems really good since we're going with buffs. With marking, anyway. Unparalleled finesse is a good option, although he doesn't have a lot of melee skills he's using. Let's just supercharge my scout chance. That feels pretty dope. And then... Um... Let's do that. Just in case we run into some big boys. Works for me. Occultist stress is kind of bad, but I don't think I need to worry about it. Alright. Hit it. Plenty of blood left to shed. Against the light, nice. our foes will fall. Yay, non-trivial illnesses. I like this new illness system a lot. Yeah, this is really, uh, really clever. All right, a little combat coming up. Got to keep in mind my bounty hunter is well buffed, <laughs> but unfortunately not against these guys. Thaumaturge and a commander. Thaumaturge. Ignores the accuracy reduction debuff in this round. Sadu! Thank you for the 52 months in the bear pot. Welcome on back in. Appreciate it. Let's go for you, I guess. Hmm. That's good. Does this this does ignore the accuracy reduction? We could try to mark the frontliners. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see how this goes. Ah, oh, it's still such a low chance to hit, though. That makes sense, I guess. Oh, we could mark another target. Or alternatively, uppercut one of these guys, and that's pretty good, too. We have some decent options for prep round for the bounty hunter. Let's double mark. Let's see how this goes. Oh, and she does mark damage, too. Oh, my God. And marks the targets. Holy shit. All right. Three marks targets. I did not realize how much synergy we had here. Okay, we're going to need to do a lot of healing already. That is a big blight. Big, big blight. Ooh. Okay, thank you. Let's see now. We're gonna go for the buff. Who's the most vulnerable? I suppose it's 
you. That'll certainly work. Thank you. Go, Bounty Hunter. Time to collect! <laughs> Ooh! 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 Uh-huh! Mark party, baby! Bringing us back to our butcher circus days. Ooh, yeah. Mark that corpse, that's right. I think I just heal through this. Arlan! Eight months on the pile. Come on back in. There's the two heal. Yeah, no, that's what we're used to, right? Armor piercing. Oh, I can't do it, though. Shadow fade it is. The mark comes with a debuff, I believe, yeah. It isn't itself a debuff. I guess I'm just letting that burn me. Although, now I don't want to. <laughs> Come hither. Get over here. Wampus. Thank you for the 30 months on the pile. Welcome on back in, Wampus. Appreciate you. Good lamb. Here we go. Oh, sick. That's convenient. All right. A little tough. We made it. Dust-coated Gvart's weapon of war. No importance. Torchlight's still looking good. Oh, we got a bleed resist charm. Cool. Might as well. Nice. Get the torchlight up. Might as well. Secure it and march Ooh, on. Cool. We still have much to do. Unfriendly skill target cure bleed. Nice. Ooh, that's really good for the Arby. Healer Arby. I like it. Jim, thank you. Appreciate it. I'm probably going to try to play more multiverse, to be honest with you. I don't think I want to give that up just yet. I think I might try to do some evening FTL streams while we're doing the Black Reliquary playthrough as well. I, think I might go crazy and get both going at once. A lot of folks have been really enjoying it just as much as I have. There's the old occultist. Tried and true, baby. Let's go there, I think. You've been going hard on multiverse. Yeah, I've even been playing offline, so yeah, I. I echo the uh, enthusiasm for it. Just did true ending for the first time. Yeah, I still got to do that too. Although that's going to be like a five and a half hour goddamn run when I eventually do it. Okay, so this is a concerning team. This is very scary. We're going to try to wipe this dude out as early as possible. That'll get us going, but of course it's going to hurt a lot too. I did see Turnit Boy commits tax evasion got a big update too, which is insane. <laughs> we might have to play that game again. Which I would be pretty excited about. Had a wonderful time with that game. Only got one day out of it though. Pistol shot. Ooh, yeah! That's the stuff. All right, Occultist, I need a little more help here, buddy. That's better. Thank you. Shadow Fade. Yeah, that Turnip Boy update's pretty sizable, I think, too. I'm very happy for them. They, they had a lot of success, I think. I'm very pleased to see it. Wait a minute. Oh, he has... Didn't this dude have the bird on his other hand last time? I could have sworn. Did they swap? No? I'm just crazy, I guess. Right. 
Because it looked to me like the bird was resting on this dude's corpse for a second. That's why I was confused. Right, yeah, it looks like he wants to hold the bird. I'm just a lunatic, I guess. Ow! Are there two different bird guys? That would explain it. That would make sense. Alright, this is bad. Obviously. Um... Nice! That's big. Oh, I might be thinking of Bird Guy's corpse. Yeah, because look, it does go over to the other side now. Or kind of to the other side, not really. Yeah, whatever. One hit KO! Close enough. Actually one HP. Oh my god. Nice! That's huge. Just miss? That's not a miss. Jeez, these bleeds are rough, man. An adequate performance for now. Keep it up. Thanks. How encouraging. Dark power in the altar. Sick. Okay. Hmm. Heal time. I'm very scared. Recover. Repair. Come dawn, we march. Wound care. Right there. Nice. Highway man is very weak. Hmm. How are their diseases doing? They're still stabilized, I think. Oh, this is just tended. I wonder if I can get to stabilized. Nah, it's the same. Oh well. Um, I'm gonna do unspeakable commune. Just to avoid the ambush, I feel like that'll be a problem if I have to deal with that. I'll go for unparalleled finesse. We have been using the melee skills a little bit. And we'll go for review contract. And let's get the extra scout. That'll work. All right, a little bit of horror here. We have laudanum, don't we? No, we don't. Let's do it. Oops, fuck. Didn't mean to do that. Mm, yeah. Okay. Sure. Thank you. I'll take trinkets. No scout there, unfortunately. I'm probably gonna have to go down the left hallway first. Nice! That's really good. Oh, apparently I missed a thing in here again, too. I keep ignoring stuff. Oh, wait, no, I'm dumb. That's the next room. Silly bear. Here we go. <laughs> oh, you're back. Oh, all right, I know to go for you first. Pain in the ass. Get rid of you. Need to heal you too. Big heal. Ah, medium heal. And a bleed. Shit. Huh. Okay. Let's see. Oh, added max HP. That's kind of cool. I feel like a knockback might be a good idea on this one. Of course, I can't stun on the prep round, though. Eh, let's just do this. This will be better. Incarnation. What does that do? Big buff. Debuff and mark resist? Oh, come on! It's like you knew! God damn it. Fucking cleared the mark on it, too. Get rid of that. There we go. That's better. Okay. Now we get to shoot you in the goddamn head. Oh shit! The he got a quirk for it. Yo, that's awesome. I love that. Yeah, let's bleed Mathis again. Why not? 
Okay, uh, let's go for another mark. Let's go for you. Little dynamic works. Yeah, that's dope, man. I like that. Big money. Oof. Yeah, oof. Oh, no. Owie. Oh, ah, good. Thank you. Thank you for the dodge. Stop it! Why? Jesus, man. Can I just get a chance at least? At least a chance here, please. Let me heal. Let me heal. We have lost the most precious treasure. Darkest dungeon, everybody. It's fair. It's a fair game. This is very fair so far. Everything's... This has gone, you know, like, I can't, why should I complain? What do I have to complain about? It's all going exactly as I could hope for. Yeah, that's a reasonable blight, too. That seems like a, that seems like the right amount. That seems good to me, is 16 on two impacts? Yeah, that's normal. There we go, good lord. How do do that? Honestly. I guess I better be better prepared next time. Yep. Yeah. Oh, good. Thank you. All right. Maybe I don't have to complain so much. All right. I'm, doing, I'm gonna do a little less complaining now. Certainly. Not as whiny anymore. Feeling a little bit more optimistic. Give him a nice pick to the face. One big bounty hunter shot. That's all I need. Come on now. Don't let him hit that. Mm -hmm. Give it to me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, that's why we stalled, right? Just so I could get that. Perfect. Holy shit. Plus two speed for every different gem in inventory. That's cool. That's a neat trinket. It's probably better than the other speed one, right? I'm gonna give that to our bounty hunter. I like that. Give up the resolve experience, I guess. Use that. Why not? Gotta make room for the amber. So... I don't think I should use all my torches now. Let's just go ahead and use a disease kit. Here we go. Hmm. Nice! A little bit more scouting to do. Okay, great. I really hope this is an empty room. Otherwise, we might be in trouble. I mean, we're already in trouble, obviously. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be able to complete this dungeon. I might have to run away from this combat. Let's find out. Let's eat a little food, actually. Just a touch. Wow! Oh my god! Oh no! Oh no! 
Um. Okay. I'll try. I'll do my best. That's good. One down. All right, now it's fair. Now we're even Stevens. That was a pretty good first round for us too. They obviously like fully wasted the heal there. Nice dodge. Okay. This is good. Mark that. Heal that. Oh, baby! That's okay. Oh! Okay! No more complaining for old bear. The tides turn. As they will. Alright, alright. Keep these marks up. Oh, that was actually, I just realized I can't hit him with a bounty hunter shot. Whoopsie. Oh my god, the occultist, though. Hard carry for the fight. Restoration? Okay. That's a big restore. Oh my god. Get over here! Oh yeah, sorry, Dusty. That was, that was kind of a funny, uh introduction to things for us. Glad you're alerted now, at least. Alright, time to mark this boy. I have to hope one of these corpses just disappears, maybe. Probably a stun, if I had to guess. If they didn't work. Beautiful. What's that buff icon? That is, uh, that is not a buff. That is expiated, which means... Uh, she will deal damage to herself if she attacks. Unfortunately, but, or, or, but unfortunately, I can't really avoid that. Well, I guess I could actually. Yeah, let's. Oh no, the shadow fade is gonna be an attack, isn't it? Yeah. Damn. Oh well. Not the dog. Oh, fucking misclick. Click the grave robber. Nice. Okay, he's still got one round of restore, but that still seems like a pretty damn good idea. Goodbye. Sick. Another skirmish, another step forward. Hmm. We follow the ever guiding light. And that, and that, and take that. Okay. Here we go. Made it through the fight. Went really well. And we absolutely want to go back this way, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, I think so. Because there's a chance that both of these rooms are empty. And that would mean only having to do one fight versus having to do a guaranteed two if we took this path. So. Here we go. Let's try to get lucky. Indeed, very lucky. Our path is revealed. March on. Okay, dump that. Come on, empty room. <laughs> Shit. All right, we know what to do. Decide. Well, I should probably try to get these guys before they transform. I guess. I'm gonna mark us. Um. Let's do this. Damn it! A nearly 90% chance to hit that. It's insane to me. Just gonna have to heal the grave robber. Actually, I like Amber on that guy. Good dodge. Alright, 
Come on now, big money. Nice! Holy shit, the bounty hunter has been huge for us. Let's go ahead and avoid a little bit of this damage here, if we can. Uh-oh. Oh, nice. Wow, we are getting really lucky. Okay, not bad. Hmm. I want to mark this guy. Too bad. Lead is rough again, though, unfortunately. Not too bad. Okay. Go for a lunge on the frontliner. This dude needs to go soon. The lead's gonna get worse and worse. Huge! Love it. Yes. Oh, boy. God, these fucking bleeds, too. Stun chance is decent, but not amazing. I think I might just want to go for the damage. Of course. Okay. They didn't stack the bleed. Very good dodge. Yeah. Okay, that's stress. That's probably fine. Good hit. Bleed's almost done. God, he almost... Or he would be dead if I landed that first shot. There we go. That's pretty big. It's not too bad. It's probably another bleed there. Bounty Hunter definitely needs another hit. Another uh, heal, I mean. Come on, buddy. <laughs> Can you add, like, another three at the end of that? That'd be a lot better for me right now. Here, try it again. Still not great. Still not amazing, buddy. Ugh. One shot KO. Or just miss completely, also acceptable, I guess. Thank you very much for that dodge. Wow. He probably would have just fucking died. 63 damage. Holy shit. Oh, yay, good bandage. That was convenient. Ooh. Gotta take another fucking fight. This is bad. Glad I had food for that. Try it. No, please, God. Oh, that didn't do anything. Okay, we're good. I need to eat before I get in there with the occultist. There we go. Yes! I thought I would have to fight again. Oh, huge. Yay. Yay. Oh, man. That's good. Get the hell out of there. Oh, boy. More Kvaritz relics out of Levantine hands. Very nice. We made it. Thank goodness. It got scary. Calm and fast learner. Huh. Alright, cool. Yeah, stay hydrated, right? Oof. Rest deeply here. We must be at our finest to succeed. Okay. Ugh. We could redu we could use some stress reduction here too. But let's go for some disease removal. You you. Get rid of bounty hunter's sweats. There we go. And then violet kitten. Gonna need some stress reduction along with cracked loaf or cracked hoof. We'll go with this, and this. Flagellation, that's fitting. And there. There we go. Grave Robber needs some help too. Let's go take a look at the fairy real fast. 
a plague doctor, a hound master, a hellion, and a leper. There we go. Let's grab them. Still no healers, though. It's pretty this bad. His greatness is not in his strength. It is in his spirit. Another hellion. Some see savagery. I see resolve. Plague doctor. There is much to be gleaned here for the alchemist and the doctor. And another hellmaster. All right. Let's run the giveaway. P-I-C-K-M-E. That's pick me. In the chat if you'd like to be chosen. Four more roster names to draw. In the meanwhile, I suppose I better figure out what the heck we're doing. So this is, uh, yet again gonna be a uh, run without a dedicated healer. And clearly the, the mod is not taking a lot of pity on us. So, four soon to be corpses, yeah. Ooh, we got our first boss available now Levantine Janissary. One of the vizier's most talented, Janissaries stand tall and proud in his camp. Boldly displaying his location to us and boasting that he will give us an honorable defeat. Hmm. Pretty sure we're going to stick with the explore here. Again, P-I-C-K, all one word in chat if you'd like to be selected. Sorry, P-I-C-K-M-E. All one word if you'd like to be chosen. Our new roster members. All right, you get out of here. What the heck are we doing? I'm gonna need a lot of support characters in this one. Probably go ahead and bring Shaggy Jackal out for an adventure. We gotta have a plague doctor, I think, for at least a little bit of healing from something. Even that's gonna be pretty bad, though. Battlefield medicine will actually be pretty nice. Should help us quite a bit. All right. Let's draw these names. Ba bam Twiggy Meat. <laughs> it's a great name for a new character. Very good. They are indeed Twiggy Meat. Ready for... Eldritch Consumption. Need a hard drave. <laughs> Welcome into the squad. Good to have you. Number three, Danfian. Welcome on into the team. Join the squad, friend. Oh, Mystic, thank you so much for the gifted subscriptions, of course. And Miniconed. Congratulations to you as well. Come on now. Edit that name. There we go. Good stuff. All right. Who's it going to be? I think Backline Plague Doctor. Perhaps the Leper as one that can heal themselves is a good option here. It seems wise to me. And then for our third liner, our third stringer, I guess I could go Houndmaster, another self-heal option. Leper is Tomo and Ruka. Okay, that's what this is supposed to be, gotcha. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Let's unequip every trinket. Sort by rarity. Oh, we could go actually with... Oh, we don't have an Arbalist, though. That's right. We've only got a Musketeer. Oh, well. Let's see. I like the speed, the Bag of Marbles. This is fun. Let's put this on the Plague Doctor to hopefully give her a fast opportunity to heal if I need it. Oh, this one? What's this? Who's that meant to be? Thanks, Daigo. Accuracy could be good on the leper here. Oh, duh, it's Josh! Right, yeah, horse face OTI. <laughs> Very nice. 
Nah, I'm honestly okay, Robin. I'll, I'll, I'll ask for it if I want it. All right. Yep, that'll work. Worry stone's fine. Less stress on the Hound Master. Yeah, that works. Let's roll with that. All right, good stuff. Make sure he has his self heal too. I'm probably not gonna go Mark Party this time. Keep the self heal. Uh, I don't think I need Cry Havoc either. I like Guard Dog. We might actually. No, I don't think I'm gonna use Blackjack this time. I'll go with Guard Dog. I like this set. Keep that guard available. Leper's ready to go. We gotta get his self heal on. I don't think I want the purge, so we'll go with Solemnity. Other religious heroes will heal from this. Unfortunately, everybody's faithless. Oh, no, the Plague Doctor will lose some stress from that. That's nice. Okay. I'll keep the hue available, too, and then Battlefield Medicine's ready to go. I think we're good. Let's do it. Hey, it's wonderful, Bill. All right, I'm ready. I think this will be our last one for today. But this has been an excellent beginning to our Black Reliquary adventure. I'm very much looking forward to playing more. This is very impressive so far. Let's go for 20 food this time. I've been liking that amount. Three keys. I think I need a lot more of these, although this time I actually have the uh, Plague Doctor, so thankfully I've got a better defense against this stuff. We'll bring a couple of disease kits. I guess I might as well bring a few ginseng powder and try those on some curios, since it's already got one in the stack there. And I don't have a Crusader this time either, so I'm going to bring a couple more torches this time as well. And shovels. Alright, so we have two inventory slots. That's not good, but... Oh, well. Oh, we have honing oil as well. I suppose I might as well bring a few of those, too. That works. Are you in the team? Are you? We got Twiggy Meat, Shaggy Jackal, Miniconed, and Danfi, and that's our squad this time. Let's do it. Let's hit it. And maybe try not to die this time, although that's obviously going to be pretty difficult, considering we, uh... Don't have a dedicated healer again. Teeming with the Kovarot people. Let us see what they have left behind. Let's see. Let's see indeed. Okay, not a bad layout again, honestly. It's been pretty kind to us with the layout so far. Now, do we have anybody that's got any specialty in the catacombs? We do indeed. Shaggy Jack. Let's take it. Leftover pottery from the Kovarot's dynasty. Only dust. Let's go, he says. Let's go! Yeah! Unnecessary hype! Completely unjustified. Our path is revealed. March on. Yeah! Okay, I want to try some stuff on this one. Coated with amber formations. No effect. No effect. No effect. No effect. No effect. Well, there is the amber specific item, I think. So maybe that's what we need to use on that. That would make sense to me. Uh, might as well. Rule a couple things out for the future, alright. Only dust. Very uneventful hallway. Alright, well, so far so good. Ah, shit. A little bit of science done. Yeah, I've got some knowledge out of that. Wow, this is... Okay. Totally fine with an entirely empty dungeon, if that's what you want to give me. Although, I, I feel like I would owe people at least one more after that, if, we're, if that were to be the case. Wouldn't feel like a proper ending today. But if you want to do it, I mean, be my guest. You keep it up, by all means. I think I'll go this way. I have a strong feeling there's a combat, either in the hallway or in the room. Um, that might be a bandage. It is! The wrapping guards against the jagged metal. Nice. That's good. There's no combat here. Wow, this is insane. 
Some cash for my aunt. Ooh. For sale or for study, these artifacts are precious. Flash fire gunpowder, a trinket we could sell if I felt so inclined. This has been maybe the easiest dungeon of all time so far. This is the lightest dungeon. The brightest dungeon. Mm, let's go with... I want to try a key. I want to try a shovel. I want to try a torch. The supply is burned! <laughs> Whoops. That's, I mean, that makes sense. <laughs> oh, let's have... I guess you do this? No, you're not pagan, so I guess I don't, I don't think it really matters. That's a directory! That's, it's a fucking... It's a map of the mall. <laughs> Just had to squint at it. Where's the Cinnabon? How's their blight resist? Pretty low. That seems like a good idea. Uh, revenge is a good idea here too, especially because his hit chance in the prep round is terrible. A little dodge, that's fine. Nice. Even still. Attribution, pitiful hit chance. I think we defend her here. Pressurize. I'm starting to fear those moves more than his actual attacks. Now that I've seen him um, load up something real fierce. This is a terrifying squad, actually. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna prioritize with these guys. It is probably still you. Unfortunately, apparently he got rid of that light. I'd like to be able to stack that up a little more. I'm not sure why I guarded the leper either. That probably wasn't the best idea. Hunting thoughts over the way. Lead time? Not a bad idea. This might be a dog biscuit fight too, actually. Nice. Cool. That's awesome, Dago. Thank you. Appreciate you watching. Yeah, sure. I think we just go for the firewalker. Uh oh. Hey, nice. Oh, shit. The skirmisher. I love it. Man, those those uh, dynamic quirks are really cool, man. Plus eight dodge when attacked by Levantine. That is awesome. I really like that. Ba boom I should probably heal for Malf. It's pretty low. Yeah. We're the best. Oof. Jeez, dude. Yeah, this guy's a big priority, too, for sure. Let's defend Malf. Um, Hugh's not a bad option here. Might one-shot this guy with a chop, though. Sensational. Nice! Okay. Big leopard damage, dude. Not gonna quite get there with that. The heal isn't extremely effective either, though, so I think I'll just do a blinding cast, actually. That seems good. Nice. Yeah, the, isn't the music really good, too? I've been very impressed with everything in this mod so far. This might actually also just be a default track. I'm not sure which ones are mod tracks and which ones are... Uh, normal game tracks. Now that I think about it, I think this is actually just a normal track. Eh, let's heal. He's gonna bleed out. Oh, wait, no, he's not. Shit. Now he is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the default track now that I think about it. Crit! Another obstacle oh, well. is clear from our path. Heal time? Nice! That's huge. Oh, I didn't realize he wasn't going to die. Shit, that was stupid. Oh, well, only seven damage. Not too bad. Actually gives us another heal opportunity. Holy cow. 
Yay. That was lucky. Okay. Well, might as well heal again. Good stuff. Um, oh boy, yeah, already running into inventory space issues. I'm gonna have him have a nice little snack there. I'm gonna probably, oh, I wish I could campfire here, that'd be way better. I might get rid of that. Having the gems is very valuable to us still because of the bag of marbles too. I guess I could just use these things. For like Let's just do that. And then we'll get rid of torches, I guess? I could probably get away with that. We follow the ever guiding light. And then we'll save the campfire for probably the next room. We got our 80% trap disarm. Very nice. Excellent. Another amber. I'm probably just gonna go ahead and try that. Nice! Oh, sick! Okay, that's really good. Let's get rid of the bandages, I guess. And we'll almost certainly can't fire in this room, but... I'm also kind of wanting to push on and... take advantage of more camp light from the campfire. More uh, shovels. Will attempt to impede us. Yeah, I think this is a better idea. We're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Oh, I even want to go one more, dude. I'm doing it. Bear greed. Extreme bear greed. Nice. Hell yeah, buff for the bear. I had ranged skills, oh baby. How useful. Cool. Awesome. Dude, super greed. Extreme greed. Only dust. Just the most greed possible. Use your senses when your vision fails you. You mean your other Bundled senses, together. right, buddy? The knights here are frigid. There we go. Do we have the ambush prevention? We don't. Damn, that sucks. Hmm. Let's go with tactics. Maintain equipment. Oh wait, right, that's the uh, companion, I forgot. Let's do it anyway. Reflection is fine. And... Sure, yeah, supply item, why not? Laudanum, all right. Cool. No ambush. The darkness will nice. Not us. We are the flame. Hell yeah. Okay, I think I gotta go to this room. We still have one campfire. Feeling good. All right. Dapper Jet. Four whole years on the pile. Bear hugs. Thank you very much for the yeah. subscription. Welcome back in. Let's get it. Very few combats in this place. Probably go for the blinding gas, give him the debuff and the prep round here. Oh boy. Okay. A little sweat. Store. Thankfully, it's on a frontliner, so it's less impactful. I think I'll go for the guard on Malfi. Let's go for that. And I like revenge, too. Yes, yeah, it's good. What's the story? How come we don't have Wayne narrating? It's a mod playthrough. You can use the exclamation point BR command in chat. That'll get you all the info about the Black Reliquary mod we are currently utilizing. I think I might actually dog biscuit this fight too, but I'm gonna wait until after the guard dog. Play grenade! No blight. A little damage, not too bad. 
Oof. That with a stun is pretty gnarly, man. I'm not actually sure if that stuns. I just feel like that's a move that probably would stun. Let's go for the repost. Seems good to me. Bounce Harry's fine here, too. Oh, never mind. It's apparently terrible. Expiated. All right. Well, restoration certainly doesn't help a lot when you get one shot. Yeah, I forgot to use the dog treat again. I'll probably do it. Ooh, Malfi. Nice one. Stun time? Nope. Time to miss. Oh, back yourself, buddy. Dog treat. Hounds Harry. Eh, let's actually go for that guy. That ought to do it. No bleed, damn. Bummer. Kind of an unfortunate use of the leper's turn here, but oh well. Quite so. Alright, time to try to heal the Hound Master a little bit, actually. Let's. Let's stun this guy. That's gonna be much better for me here. And let's defend Malfi for a second. While he uh, heals himself. Very good. Kind of a waste of the dog treat. Oh well. There we go, nice. And we get a nice big shot right there. Oh my god, the leper. Destroyed. That is quite accurate. Big damage. Take some hits. We're gonna get some self heals off actually for these next few turns for sure. The bones are mending. Press on. This is really good writing, I gotta say, for the mod too. The lines for the narrator are really fitting for the game. I like it a lot. Heal up. Back to full, baby. Love it, love it, love it. Miss. Nice. Goodbye. Alright. We'll just use that and then hopefully make room for the Valor Marks here. I might be able to get away without a uh, shovel here. Oh, Laudanum. No, never mind. There we go. Boom. Nice. Let's just use that. Oh, can't use it. There we go. And... I guess... The... Dog treat. Yeah, I'm doing it. Ah, poor doggy. He's so sad watching me throw his dog treat into the abyss. But I wanted that. I was gonna be a good doggo. The very best. Hey. Our cause is righteous, but requires funds. Apparently those don't do anything, okay. That's fine. Time to camp right here. Punchy boy. So we gotta get rid of these things, I guess, so they don't respawn. Uh, what is the debuff? Accuracy and dodge? That's probably worth going for. Seems pretty good. Nice. Missed it again. Yeah, alright. Go Malfi. Ah, you big dumb idiots. You're supposed to land your attacks, don't you know? These, these fools. These absolute fools. Good old revenge. For a big old leper, dude. Nice. There we go. I want to pop a couple of heals on my or on my uh, man at arms here, but play grenades are very good too. The light resist is pretty low. Yeah, for this mod to be in point one is already very, very impressive stuff. Bright future here. Perhaps semi-ironically. 
Light's doing work on those guys. It's very nice. Their bleed resistance is through the roof, though, so that's obviously going to be less effective. Okay, that was a fun turn. One HP. Bear optimal. God damn it. We're doing. Damn, these guys are fast. There we go. No bleed, obviously. I was just trying to get that guy finished. Try to knock that out, too. Very good. Um, I guess I just crushed this guy. That'll do. Awesome. Alright, time for some healing. Tiny bit by tiny bit, we bring the man at arms back. As he continues to get whacked. Nice. Holy shit, the loot. The loot. The loot. Let's do. Oh man, I gotta gamble on the shovels here, I think. Yeah. It's gotta happen. I'm gonna throw that dodge stone out. Time to camp. Hit it. Togetherness is a rare thing in this place. Okay, good stuff. Leper is going to... Let's see. Maintain tactics on my Hound Master for the dodge. Release the Hound for the scout chance. And that'll have to do. Put the mask down, doesn't really seem like a good idea. That's actually fairly balanced. Ah, never mind, it's not worth it. Ambush! No, not you! Oh, fuck. Oh, this is a really bad ambush. Oh, God. scary. Mm -hmm. I better just... No, I don't think I can move forward here. Fuck. Oh, boy. Gotta move the Houndmaster back. We're gonna go for the fucking chest cave on the first move, huh? Good lord. Alright, I like trying to go for Blight on these guys. Damage over time on the champ. He's the champ! No more dog treats for me. Not too bad. Ow. Okay. Hurts. Extra damage taken. Jesus Christ. That sucks. Healing. Come on, Leper. Let's get a big one, buddy. Hit it! Mmm! These. The dodge chance is different from the hit percentage, isn't it? Are they like different? Calculations? Because I swear to God, this thing is getting hit way less than it should be. It's been really unlucky. Yikes. Hopefully I still have anti venom. Group heal. That's really bad. Oh man. Chest caver, right? Oh, okay, here we go. That's kind of a blessing. 
got his repost active now, unfortunately, though. I think I need to heal. Nah, that's probably not a good idea. <laughs> Thank God, man. Jeez. He's being a pain in the ass. Get rid of this. There we go. It's probably stun time. Like, honestly, what is happening? I swear to God, percentages are not being reflected accurately. Like, the, t the amount of times we've failed on an 80% success rate so far is, just seems completely ridiculous to me. I guess it's just Darkest Dungeon again, huh? Friendly Shambler! Welcome Thank you very much for the 37 months on the bear pile. Welcome on back into you. Appreciate it. There we go. That's a little helpful. Okay, that is almost enough bleed. Nearly there. Oh no, is that a heal? Get rid of the bleed too. Yikes. A big blight. Activate that and chance it. Nice! That was lucky. Really good. Okay. Two HP. Almost there. There we go. Champion down. Holy shit. Nice. Now well, he's gonna do that and heal up. Big heal from Malfi. Self heal there. Oh, that's good to hear, Shambler. The feeling is mutual. Dodge. Nice. Jesus, man. Our foes will fall. That was rough. That was really bad. Uh, I want that. I really want that. I'm gonna take it over this, I guess. Ah, shit. Alright. Okay. It's almost time to get rid of those keys. I, I fucking got rid of the shovels right before that. Oh, that's terrible, man. That sucks. Here's a shovel. That would have been funny, but all right. There we go. Not enough room for the money. Time to dump the keys, I guess. Which I probably should have used one on, on that, I guess. No, God. Man. I didn't mean to do that! Fuck. Oh well. I think it's time to retribution right away. Even if it misses, it's good to get the repost up. Chance is terrible, so let's just do this. That doesn't surprise me, yeah, I think it's probably true for a lot of people. Raise your hand if you discovered me via Darkest Dungeon. First thing you ever saw me play was this game. It's probably a big handful. A sizable handful. Either that or Spelunky, yeah, one of the two probably. Death Road to Canada, sadly. That's not sad, that's awesome. Rocket League, nice, that's dope. Uh, I can probably get aggressive here. 
92% chance to hit, you'd certainly hope so. There we go. You found me today? Oh, that's pretty dope, Mystic. You've been very kind to me for someone that just found me today. You've been very generous. Yeah, these enemy designs are really good, aren't they? I'm really impressed with them. The whole mod, man, it's all pretty top-tier stuff. This fight's going really well. Very happy with this. Ah, shit. I had to say something, didn't I? Booyah! Oh, man. Amazing. And goodbye. That ought to do it for the up. Oh, never mind. All right, here comes the one-shot kill from the. Uh, oh, never mind. Lights enough. Sweet. Goodbye. Ooh, the big crit from Shaggy. Nice. That real quick. There we go. Problem solved. Oh, look, we got a pull for it. Nice, that's fun. That's good information. I think we're gonna make it, man. This dungeon certainly got a lot more interesting. It was a little boring in the beginning. Ah, shit. All right, here we go. Actually get to do the proper starting move here. That's nice. Oh, those guys are scary. Okay, we don't want to... We don't want to see what the result of that is. I don't want them to be taking shots. Let's avoid that. The body fails to stand. Nice. I like this still. And then I'll probably just yeah. self heal, I guess, on the Hound Master. Yeah. Nice crit. Alright, good enough. Beautiful. Oof. Okay, yeah, Man at Arms is in bad shape. This is looking rough. I think I'm gonna have the Houndmaster guard the man at arms now, too. Yeah, that seems wise. Other NLSS members wins the poll, not too surprising. We've got good friends. I guess I could increase my protection on him there, that might not be a bad idea. Stun seems pretty good, too, though. Alright, yeah, no, we wanna keep that the way it is because of the, uh, the guard at the moment. Big damage. Good stuff. Play grenade's probably okay here, but I think I might actually be better off going with this. Then again, I think I actually want to heal for two. I think it might be pretty good for me to try to desperately heal here. Because this is scary. These two are doing a lot of damage. That stun is really convenient for sure. That hurts. Nice! Got the quirk. Big time. Good. And retribution. Oh, bear optimal again, man. God damn it. Alright, let's go for... I guess we should probably just kill this guy. Yeah, that's probably for the best. I'll, uh... Defender. Get my protection stat up. Guard dog him. And that way I shouldn't allow the man at arms to get hit by this at all. There we go. Nice, beautiful. Perfect. A little bit more healing. Hopefully it doesn't catch my cheesing here. Because I am cheesing this a little bit. And... Oh, that's neat, Robin. 
to pay more attention to that, I guess. I think we probably want to get the repost up. Probably want to do another self-heal. Nice! That's really good. Just gonna keep trying to heal here. Every little bit's gonna help the, the man at arms for sure. There we go. We press on. There is much to do. No more trinket space. I just gotta get rid of that. Alright, here we go. Yay! More amber. Sick. Okay. Uh, let's have you eat two food as well real fast. And pray for an empty room. Let's go! He's done it. He's done it. Yes, sir. Hit it. Out of here. More Pervrot's relics picked out of Levantine. Hands. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Oh, that's a nice haul right there, man. That feels good. That feels terrific. Lots of cash. No one died. Wow, it's a miracle. Turns out we can go on a run and not kill anyone. I can't believe it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we got a lot of uh, currencies for that. Awesome. Good experience. Two level two characters. Old leader. Oh, soft for Shaggy Jackal and scattering. Ah, oh, damn. Plus 20% damage if health is at max. Nice. That's cool. Not very effective for a, a Plague Doctor, unfortunately, but that's a cool cool quirk. To return here after so long, it is difficult to describe exactly what this land means to me. That was a very good week for us. It went really well. Nice. Oh, a Vestal, finally! Yay! Faith and caregiving are indispensable qualities in these lands. A flagellant? And an apprentice antiquary. A woman that knows the real treasures of this place will be truly invaluable. Very nice. Let's do one last pick me here, shall we? Let's do one last pick me here for the folks sticking around to the end. As we wrap things up. Let me do the uh, new one actually, so do it now. P-I-C-K-M-E in the chat, all one word. If you'd like to be selected, we'll do three more names here for the very end of the stream. That is going to wrap it up for me for now, though. Thank you so much for watching Black Reliquary, and thank you for watching some Darkest Dungeon today, everybody. Really appreciate your support. Thank you so, so much for all the subs, tips, and bits. We'll be back, if not tonight, for maybe a little bit more multiverse. I'm thinking we might actually do that. Uh, if not, then we'll definitely see you back here tomorrow morning for more Black Reliquary mod. This has been... A very exciting start. This has a truckload of potential from what I can see so far, and I'm very excited to play more.